Number one question that I get asked is how do I get motivated to eat healthy and exercise? The first thing you have to know is that motivation is complete bullshit. You are not going to wake up one day and say, wow, I am so motivated to eat healthy and work out. Everybody, myself included, would rather lay under the covers for an hour, two hours, not go to work, or, you know, cozy up with some hot chocolate, with whipped cream, ice cream, and you can't be doing that and expect to get motivated from somewhere. Motivation is not going to come from just anywhere. If you're expected to just be motivated and from that motivation take action and from that, that action get results, you're going to be waiting a long, long time. How it actually works is you have to take action first. From that action, you're going to see some results. And from those results, they are going to keep this loop going and you're going to become so much more motivated in who you are becoming. If you are watching this YouTube video and you're having an aha moment, I want you to stop watching YouTube and go take action. Next, you're probably wondering, do I start with exercise or nutrition? My answer is start with the one that you enjoy the most. Personally, I like to start with the diet because you're going to get more bang for your buck. But starting with exercise is a whole lot easier. Why? Well, it's super easy just to go for a 20 minute walk or do, you know, a few sets of push ups rather than changing your diet. The best part is once you start doing either one of these, you are going to start to see some results. To start with exercise, I find that a lot of my clients, they become more motivated to then track their nutrition. Okay. Remember that exercise increases our confidence. It increases our endorphins and makes us feel very, very good. Remember that something is always better than nothing. You don't have to go to the gym for an hour if you do not have the time or, you know, if you are just a beginner, you can start small. If you're a beginner to exercise, you can do some circuits. So like choose three exercises and set a time frame for it. Let's say you want to do 15 minutes. So you choose three exercises that you can do. Um, you know, you can count your reps, you can count the time, but as long as you do something again, it is better than nothing. And then how you can progress that week after week after week is adding more reps into it or more weight to your exercises um, so that you can and keep getting stronger and again from that you're just going to see some results and then when you are ready to track your food I would suggest not just going to my fitness pal right away is to just write what you are eating down be super honest with yourself and like if you're drinking hot chocolate with whipped cream write that down if you are eating two and a half pieces of chicken nuggets um, off your kids plate write that down because you want to have a baseline that you are starting with so that you can actually make some healthy swaps. I hope this helped. Let me know in the comments below what other videos you'd like to see next. That's it for me, guys. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Follow me on Instagram. And I'll see you next time. Bye.